some team has been working on Final Fantasy 14 Mobile for like five years from what they told us or what they've shared so far, which is wild to me, but they shadow dropped this out of nowhere. They haven't really shared a whole lot about it. I, I Other than Yoshi P has been very clear, it will not have gotcha mechanics and it will not be overly monetized. My hunch is it's going to be a subscription-based mobile game. Much like FF14. But all we really know is, is that it's going to cover... I think up to a... Like, most of A Realm Reborn up to 2.0. And then that's about it for now. So, I, there's not a whole lot to talk about other than... There is an interview that Yoshi P gave... Where he went over and uh, at the key mochi translated some of it and posted it. People have asked how we will monetize the FF14 mobile game. For example, some games are made with gotcha schemes so that they can make as much money as possible. That's not what we're about. With respect to the original FF14, we designed the mobile game with one thing in mind. Exactly how long could a mobile user play this game? We want each single player to enjoy FF14 as long as they can. Therefore, our goal is to allow as many people to play the game as much as possible while only receiving just a bit of cash as monetization. So please don't worry about how much it'll cost. I'll be happy if you can in just enjoy the game. Rich was super skeptical about this for good reason. I, I don't understand how they're going to do this though because it sounds like a simplified version of FF. There's no crossplay. If anyone's curious, it is not going to be cross-play compatible with FF14, which is even more intriguing. I, so it's its own standalone product entirely. It's apparently going to launch in China first and then come out globally. So I don't know. The concept images they showed off all had the original crew. I'm assuming it... It's not going to just be this. I'm assuming it's going to be a like a smaller, more compact version of FF14, but maybe it'll be like a proper single player thing. Like maybe it'll be full single player, which would be very odd to have the single player version of FF14 be like a mobile game first. <laughs> that would be very weird. Thank God for no crossplay because could you imagine raiding with a mobile user? I've raided with controller users. Can't be much different. I say as someone who plays this game on an ROG ally. <laughs> but there was a cool little post on the mobile site where they talked about how they came to Yoshi P with a 100 page proposal and like halfway through it, he started actually going through ideas on a blackboard with them while they were still giving their presentation. Like it, it if you want to read this, I'll put it in the discord. But it seems like the people making it care. So I don't expect it to be too crazy. So shade me. Shade at me, I heard. What do you mean? Oh, controller player? Well, you're the one that can't solve jump puzzles. So all I'm saying is Kugane Tower will weed out those who are unworthy of praise.